You know those satisfying cleaning videos where jewelry goes from grimy to gleaming? You probably think it's just soap and water doing the work. You're completely wrong. And what's actually happening is way cooler. When a ring hits the water in an ultrasonic cleaner, black sludge erupts from nowhere. It's not a chemical reaction, it's physics weaponized against dirt. Your gold chain looks flawless to the naked eye, but drop it in the machine and suddenly the water turns disgusting. Under a microscope, that smooth surface is covered in scratches and crevices packed with grime you've been wearing for months. Ultrasonic cleaners exploit cavitation. Sound waves vibrate through water, squeezing molecules until they form countless microscopic vacuum bubbles. These bubbles are invisible but brutal. When they hit jewelry and collapse, they release shockwaves. Don't underestimate them, because they're tiny. Each bubble acts like a miniature hammer, pounding dirt relentlessly. Even a decade-old gold tooth emerges sparkling beyond jewelry. You can clean almost anything, but ultrasonic cleaning isn't magic. It has limits. Anything too soft or brittle is at risk. Severely rusted metal? Also problematic. Those explosive bubble shock waves that obliterate dirt. They can warp soft materials or crack fragile ones. You might put in a vintage watch and pull out expensive scrap. The technology is incredible. Millions of invisible explosions per second, each one precisely targeting microscopic filth. But it's also indiscriminate violence at a molecular level. So yes, your jewelry is way dirtier than you thought. And yes, there's a machine that uses controlled chaos to fix it. Just maybe don't put your grandmother's pearls in there.